What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. Let's go get ourselves a Sunwing. Okay, I need to find a Sunwing to override. Better head up the mountain. I remember seeing some right there because I remember I was uh I needed sunwing parts and we came out of the base and murdered them one time I'm curious though will this overtake my mount sunwing's not bad though because the Glen Hawks are like, eh. Stormbird would be dope. But I can do with a Sunwing. Good. There are Sunwings up here. We'll have to approach them quietly. Go <laughs> obtain Sunwing Call. So is that separate? Okay, hang on. Uh, where am I flying? I could go. Oh my god. Whoa, head rush. Tilda, I'm in the air. Then you'll want to pick up an energy cell on one of the ancient Horus Titans. But first, you must send out a pulse to activate them. I've sent you the necessary software. To deploy it, you'll have to override one of the communication machines you refer to as Tolnex. There's one in the middle of the desert that should do nice. Flying one that I was never able to get. On it. For a while, I thought it was just like missing. Okay, this, this is, oh, this is fucking cool. I mean, there, there, there is need to get on top of its head. constant hints at uh, at flying being in the game. Okay, Tilda, I've overridden the tall neck. Good, and the energy cells are now primed. Simply pick one up on a Horus. The nearest one should be northwest of your position. Dropping it on Regala's machine should produce quite a spectacle. Thanks for the assist. I told you, I want to help. Someone call and then use it. Whoa! <laughs> we'll just summon straight over and we can start flying. Ooh, this is freaking nuts. Never again shall I put up with janky platforming where Aloy can't grip. I can now fly to drop anywhere I want. I can also do some certain quests. Some... Oh, everything's on hold. Okay. So we got to do the... We're, we're going to do the battle. Take her down. We'll, we'll probably go until I get the thing where it's like... Um, you know, there'll be a point where it's basically like, Alright, this is it. Main battle's coming up. If there's anything you want to do, now's the time to do it. Hmm. 
Where's the energy cell? Time's back. Got the cell. Now on to the grove. Pulse from Tolak should have reactivated all the energy cells in the region. I should be able to pick up more from the horse I fly to. Pretty useful. Even after I deal with the bell. Straight EMP bomb, a bunch of machines. It's really cool that like I wasn't sure how this was gonna be, but the fact that we just we can just call it at any time now. Like, oh you know what? I think I wanna mount like cause so now with Velociraptor, he's just gonna be like a combat call. Like, I need a homie to fight with me. And anytime I need to travel, might as well go by sky. I wish the camera wouldn't autofocus like that. Alright, here we go. Now on your knees, and I'll give you the death you didn't have the spine to give me. They're down! The machines! All of them! They're down! What? How's that possible? Regala! <laughs> Enough bloodshed! Let's settle this. You and me. Easy to say when you're atop a machine. Well, that was just to get your attention. I don't need any help to take you down. Ooh. Fine. I accept your challenge. And once I'm done with you, I'll get to finish the slaughter. Lady, we'll see about I already... That. The duel is set. Let none interfere. I've already beaten the Enduring. If it was on easy, but we're not going to talk about that. like changing the cow, do you? Try something. Okay. 
I can't use rope casters on people. Lady, you're the one that's hiding up top. Alright, her blocks are really annoying, but okay. Dodge that. Here I am again. On my knees before bootlets and cowards. Go ahead. Run me through. Shut your mouth, traitor. It was you who flew in on the wings of the ten. You who challenged her by our rights, you must decide her fate. I spared her once. It only made things worse. She was the best of my marshals. What a waste. She's dangerous, all right. But maybe that's exactly what I need. Cowards! What more do you have to conspire about? Whether you live or die. Hmm. I give her a chance to fight? This isn't easy, and life ends here. I wonder what the this isn't easy option does. You led a rebellion that tore a tribe apart. All for bloodlust and revenge. Maybe the only thing you deserve is to die right here. Or maybe... That fury can be directed at the real enemy. You want to ally with her? How can you even trust her? Despite all that she's done, she's never been one to break her word. And will she give it? I won't beg for my life. Decide. Oh, man. Uh, I mean, she's not like inherently like, yeah, she started war, blah, blah, blah. But like, I don't know. She's not like, you know, there's like sometimes you get bad guys that are like, oh, this person's a real piece of shit. Like Ted Farrow. Ted Farrow is a real piece of shit. She just seems like a warrior that you know, 
Hmm. I'm not here to forgive you for your crimes. But there's another battle ahead. Against an enemy more powerful than anything you can imagine. And I need people. A squad. That's willing to do whatever it takes. I don't want your mercy. It's not mercy. The battle I'm talking about... ...will be charging into a nightmare. A better death than this? Yes. My blood is yours. Your enemies are mine. Meet us at our stronghold. ...in the mountains near Plainsong. You mean to send her alone? Without even an armed guard? She does not need it. I will be there. You have my word. I'll hold you to it. Chief, there's something you both need to see. In the throne room. I wonder if I had done the quest to get... Uh, due to his arm, if he would have it during all these cutscenes. He surrendered to our guards outside the grove. Claims he has an urgent message for the Outlander who defeated Regala. So, state it. It's for her alone. From an interested party. Silence. I'm gonna need some privacy. Clear the room. Put him with the rest of Regala soldiers. I'll see you back at base. You saved the tribe. Let me help you with your mission. No. With Regala gone, you have a chance to build the future you dreamed of. So get to your task. Then at least allow me to give you this. Armor for the battle ahead. May it keep you safe. Thank you. It's a pleasure to see you too, Silence. Congratulations on your victory. You saved the Tanakh for a few weeks. Unfortunately, you doomed the entire planet as well. Wrong. I don't need a Tanakh army to defeat the Xenos. Oh, Eloy. Have you learned nothing about the enemy we were up against? More than you, hiding whatever hole you found. My idea is just better than anything you ever came up with. No, not here. We're doing this my way. Face to face, and with the weapon you've developed. And why would I agree to that? Because I'm your only way of beating the Zeniths, and getting the copy of Apollo that's on their ship. So meet me at my base. Mountains west of Plainsong. Time to submit to the inevitable silence and follow the person who actually knows what she's doing. <laughs> I like this interaction. It. Tilda, you there? I did it. Not High Marshal. Well, it could have been legendary. It looks pretty cool, though. Silence is on board, so head to my base. Impressive. Very angry. I'll be there as soon as I can. I don't even bother looking at it. I'll put this back on. Resonator last, melee, low health melee, and then mounted archer. Not bad. Um, 
I mean, it's I guess for for a melee setup, Resonator Blast plus melee is pretty good. Now that I can fly, I might want to see what else I can do before I head back. Yes, indeed. There is quite a few things I would like to do. Um, errands. This. Not fast travel at this time. I was already up there. It's time to go up and actually get the armor. The fact that you need flying for it, and it's four separate pieces, I'm thinking that might be legendary. Steady there. The fact that we can just call a freaking flying mount and go wherever we want now. Still haven't found that apex though that I need. How it just swoops down and picks you up. This is where we part ways. Fragment of Farika's armor. Okay, yeah, that wasn't there the last time I was up here. I was curious. I I got I basically like was way up there and made my way around. Probably a storm bird that's gonna show up to fight us when we pick up these pizzas. It must be the storm bird that killed Farika. Get it once electrified. No! That's what I'm talking about. Blew that part off.
There we go. No! Oh, it's gone. Oh, this one I got. Not even a threat anymore now that already blew up the chest. Trying to hit this thing is obnoxious. Okay. Did you die already? Making me do the stormbird. One more bit of armor. Watch the machine. My focus might see something. Was that Falcus Bracers? So the Stormbird had one piece. I mean, I grabbed one over here at the start. I grabbed one over here in the middle of the fight. Oh, it's right here. Looks like another bit of armor. I guess that's it then. I should let the Tanakh know I recovered what's left. Seize legendary. I'm surprised I haven't found any other source of uh, legendary gear yet. We saw you fly. Did you find Farika? I was able to retrieve her armor. What's left of it anyway? She didn't stand a chance against that Stormbird. Ah, uh, I see. A painful end. But not without glory. So, what do you think? Was she the first to fly on the wings of the Ten? She was brave. And spent a fair amount of time in the air. I'd say what she did qualifies. She flew! I knew it! The first to fly! 
As her successor, you should keep her armor. You can fix it up at the workbench. This way. Is it good? Once you repair the armor, you're welcome to it. You take after Farika. Bold, brave, and a diplomatic liar. She met a harsh fate. Let her have the title. Fair enough. It's kind of you to show such humility. First to fly by getting ripped apart by a giant bird. Sky Climber. Let's take a look. Oh, this look pretty cool. Uh, concentration, concentration, regen, potent medicine, food duration. It's not bad. Like, if I didn't have the legendary set, I'd probably run that just for the concentration regen. But uh, this is hard to beat. Thunder Warrior set is pretty insane. Okay, um, I had another quest to fly... That's just 5,000 XP in a skill point. Not as interesting as an armor. Um, ready? Side quest? I want to get dude his arm. Oh no, it's this one. Fly oh, way home, 8,002. I could do a ship. Snapshell circulator, force loader, ancient sculpture. I think I have most of this stuff. Let's see. Yeah, what was lost. So, all right, we're going to wrap things up here. Um, we're going to get Kotalo his arm, and then I, I may do the other flying-related mission in the next part before we continue on. So, y'all stay tuned. We'll have more coming your way soon enough.